All right, this is Bill Mara, I'm N2CQR, and I blame this video on Pete Giuliano N6QW and on my son Billy. Uh, Pete has encouraged me to get back into tube type radios, and Billy encouraged me to get this new camera so we could do some video projects. This is the first video project, and I'm hoping that it works out okay. This is an old Regen radio or TRF radio that I bought at the Kempton Park Rally in London many years ago. And because Pete is pushing me back into tubes, I dragged it out and I'm going to try to get it working. It's got a really nice reduction drive up on the front, little on off switch, kind of a homebrew uh, metalwork construction on the front panel. I'll flip it around. On the back, you can see really interesting stuff a wooden chassis, nice little brass tuning capacitor, variable capacitor. You got an Edistone uh, plug in coil. The uh, Feedback is controlled by this very nice, also brass, variable capacitor with a reduction drive. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's really kind of nice. You, know, you think some radio amateur back in the 1920s or 1930s went to a lot of trouble on this thing. He's got a lot of extra holes in it. And that, for me, indicates that he made a lot of modifications and might have tried out several different circuits. Um, I've tried to work out the schematic, and uh, this is my latest version of what I think we're working with. I also did some Googling and came up with stuff like this that is pretty close to what I'm finding in this old rig. I'll just flip over so you can take a look at the bottom underneath the kind of wiring that they did in the 20s or 30s. You can see it there, it's all point to point. The resistors are obviously ancient and uh, I'm really kind of intrigued by this thing and I'd like to see if I can get, try to get it working. So <clears throat> stay tuned, listen to the podcast, watch for new uh, video updates, and thanks for uh, bearing with me on this, my first video experience with the new camera.